demonstration of fishing net. Maybe this may be. Yeah, that, that's why I need two opposite like this. Yeah. This is for the uh, flower. Another, yeah. I'm sorry, I don't think it's getting here. I thought it was okay. the flower, but maybe yeah. it's the fishing net. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I think I s okay. half, half, not cut it off. And then the yeah. half, the same size thick one. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's oh, one. You see that? You see that? And you repeat at the first time. You repeat again at the first time. Yeah. So it might need a bit of time and patience. Exactly. Oh, exactly. How many times yeah. did he do this wrong before he was able to do it right? Oh, he's awesome again. Yeah, maybe he when rest, he's done. When he he's rested done. a lot of the account. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What was he supposed to call? He's cutting down about halfway, but not quite halfway. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. And he's making them about what? Two millimeters thick? Oh, I don't think no, that. It's a, no. It's a one. Yeah, no. One millimeter yeah. thick. Oh, I don't even know. Maybe. Two millimeters. Right, I'm thinking centimeters. I'm sorry. So you're well, probably hey, right. Hey, I was trying to be nice to the Canadians yeah. and the Europeans. No, we should you were right on. John, you will this publish will publish this on Yes, your I will, sir. Okay, yeah. great. Oh so, yeah, we've so got a video. I don't have to make a photo <laughs> because I have John's. Ah uh, yes. Follow, Facebook. He, follow Facebook. his page. Yes. Yeah. John Light Travel. And and see the trip you were on. <laughs> yeah. 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 And see me. And see me. Oh. Yeah. See what you missed yes, on the trip you were on. So we have a mission. Yeah. And our chef's name is Un, correct? Un, yes. And we are being demonstrating right now. This is a, a G, best a G Adventures Best of Vietnam, and we have uh, people here from Australia, from England, and a lot of Canucks, and definitely Deutschland. Okay. And only one American, because the rest of you Americans will not get out of your safety zone and come out here and see the world. So come on out. We just had an amazing dinner with these people. Uh, fantastic. I can't tell you how well um, we were talking about, uh, Heather, we were talking about how that they, the presentation of the food, how much that they, how much they care, how much they care for how not only the food tastes, but how it looks when it comes to the table. And, and it was because they took the time and effort like this gentleman's doing right now to really honor the food and make sure that the um, person receiving it knows that what love and care that they put into it. And I'm trying to put some things in here you guys can add in as you go because this is going to get kind of boring unless you guys talk. <laughs> I still can't quite see how this Whoa, is going to... just wait. I think you're going to get a magic reveal. I, I, I think yeah. so, but I, I, I still find it hard to believe. Patience. Yeah. So what we're, what they're demonstrating here, we were serving, I, I took a picture of it earlier and I'll post that, is they took a picture of a, a, a fish, but they put the fish inside of a net and the net was made of carrots. So what you're seeing him do right now is make that actual net. Does Ann always demonstrate for the adventure people? Uh, oh, uh, he's there, so nice. He's the full, full time <laughs> for, for this boat, so yeah. all the time when the travelers work in, um, on this boat, so they get a for them. But sometimes you go to another boat, maybe another chef when I do this boat. Oh, yeah. he's doing very well. So. And we have all the rest of our wonderful people here tonight. I'm going to take a little pause, come to show all the wonderful people here. This is the birthday girl right here. She just had a birthday. And these are the most friendly and good people and Germans that I've ever met in my life. Most of the, sorry my German friends, I've got a lot of German friends and they know that they're stuffy with their ties on and shirts and, are, and some more with Canucks. I look over there and our a young lady from uh, England having a great time and our representatives from, New, from Australia over there who, uh, let me tell you what, there's no moonshine, moonshine left in, in uh, the village we just came from. Yeah. And we are continuing i probably have to edit this video out, but we're continuing here what's going on with this guy making his fishing net. So maybe these comments will make it in there or not. I'll make run out of memory before this is over with. <laughs> a small one might do. I should have just did a live feed. That would have been pretty cool. People could have watched and gotten going with all that. We also 
you can do time for decoration. You know, if you have to yes. cheat, you can. But th this really does go to show you how much care the chef goes to making just a presentation because this is just one net and we had three, four tables. So he had to do this three or four times. What for he each. Is in, in uh, Vietnam, you care about food. You care about the ingredients. You care about the preparation. You care to be with family when you eat it, right? Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <coughs> that, that, that is part of the Al Vietnamese cuisine culture. Hmm. So what, how, who influenced this Vietnamese culture? Oh, uh, Vietnamese to, people. I mean, what, okay, no, I don't want to just like, because I know you're not like really good friends with the French, and, but they had a big <laughs> deal with, with cuisine. But, but uh, so was that there always, it's always been part of the Vietnamese culture to, to really, to really care about how they present the food? Uh, yes, uh, when you had a party at home, yeah, so okay. you not only eat in a, uh, the taste of food, but you also eat by eyes, by nose, yeah. So the oh. a presentation that it uh, also stimulate all the senses. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, it's fantastic. And we talked about this water. They said there's really cold water with some salt in it to make it stiff. And I think that's what we're doing to do this. And we were, uh, oh, that's getting ready. Yeah, something get ready to happen here. Oh, oh. The big oh. Now he's going to put the slice. Oh, wait, Hold wait, wait, on. Wait. You're going to slide it. Like, slide wait, 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 wait. it. Like if you, when you feel oh. it. The, 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 <coughs> When you feel it, the, the fish. No. See, I did oh. not no. see that coming. Oh, I understand. Oh okay, this okay, so if anybody's That's still watching at home in the six That's minutes the part into this. I couldn't do. It's yeah. impossible. I mean, he is slicing about one millimeter into this carrot all the way around oh my goodness. as he does this. This is really, truly amazing, people. And he has five fingers on this. Yeah, and he's still got all his fingers, and none of it's turned uh, red, so uh, we're doing pretty good here. Yeah. So that spirals right down, oh. like he can keep cutting. He doesn't just get one yeah. ring here. Oh. You do this one at home, so please be careful. Otherwise, I don't think I'm going to be doing this at home. We'll do this slice. Uh, and we're right currently right now at Ha Long Bay. Uh, I don't know if you saw the picture of the sunset here, but this is one of the most gorgeous places in the world. We were able to go out today and uh, have a have a look at. They've got this magnificent cave nearby. Uh, our guide, when, and when I talk about guides, the really truly good guides know when to go to certain places. And it was uh, uh, Mr. Dong took us today at exactly the right time. The cave wasn't crowded, and then he gave us exactly the right amount of time to get us over to the island where we could go to the top of the observation point to see the sunset. And the sunset was incredible here. It is one place that you guys need to come. You need to come to Vietnam and see uh, the sunset here in Ha Long Bay. It's one of the things you need to do before you die. Okay? Mm. <laughs> I'm trying to do my best here, people. Go, go, go. Yeah, the, concent this, the concentration in this is just... It is astounding, isn't it? Not what we're doing well, here. You weren't concentrating. So look, well, we can zoom in here. You've got a very sharp look knife. Look at there. a very, very sharp knife. The knives are very big here. Yeah, you have to sharpen it before it's not very big. I mean, he's slicing. And and I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you another question while he's continuing to sharpen. I notice he has a wedding band on. So the Vietnamese people wear wedding bands. Oh. Wedding band? Yeah. <laughs> He has a wedding go wedding band. Is that normal for everybody when they get married here? They they do a, do a wedding band. Oh yes. Okay. Our traditional custom. Okay. Yeah, so now with the flowers. Mm -hmm. Oh. Then guess what kind of flower? Okay. Now I I run out at oh, ten lotus. minutes because that's the amount I can do. Uh, to leave, like uh, to look lotus. So, what what is it? This is a carrot flower. You <laughs> asked. <laughs> um, and the, and, the, and the, thing, uh, the thing about our guide, our guide has, uh, he really wants to be a stand-up comedian, but I, I, I have explained to him that there's 10,000 comedians out of work right now, and he's trying to break into the business. Okay? So, um, not really sure if he's going to make it or not. We're thinking about firing him from that position. He needs to just stick to being a guide. <laughs> 
Was this <laughs> carrot? Was this carrot soaked too? I'm sorry. Was yeah. this carrot we'll soaked as well? Yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna be all right. Hopefully, <laughs> yes. You see, I've got again. I've got the giggling Germans in behind me here. That's been entertaining me the whole last couple of days. <laughs> no, they're not full of uh, Jägermeister or freezing guys. They're just having a good time, every which way they're going. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we got the we got the flower going here now. Carving here. It is amazing this guy does not cut himself because I would have been like, hey, okay. And this is part of the food. We, every table had um, four or five flowers made like this um, into a vase that was presented with our shrimp cocktails. Very pretty. And the tomatoes, the fruit. And so you can oh, see that he tomatoes. did this for three or four tables just to take the time to do this with fresh carrots. I thought the power had gone out and they were bringing candles. Oh, yeah. and yeah, I, I didn't record that, but they had a presentation of, um, with a, um, in the dark, of, um, they took taken tomatoes and cut out the center and made them into a tulip, and they were using some type of gel or something, I guess, in the bottom. As a as a candle, to uh, service uh, service that that part of the dinner. So uh, anybody else that's watching from my Cro Croatia <coughs> feed, they will have to make sure that they up their up their up their stance a little bit as far as the food being presented. Because I'm telling you what, I'm pretty impressed at this point. I mean, I, United States and Germany, I think I was um, very impressed by the um, big Sunday, I forgot what they call them, Sunday brunches, I call them over in Germany. I went over in uh, Berlin and some of the hotels had big, huge uh, buffets and they would have these big, massive ice sculptures and every kind of food that you could imagine. Uh, I was thinking of Schweizerhof, I'm trying to think it was in Berlin I went to and I was amazed at the detail that they did with the ice sculptures with these guys here oh my making these flowers it's just truly amazing let's see you pull the net apart there he's left that in there he's gonna make it into a fishing net uh, gonna dry it out okay Lay it out there. Wow. 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 Wonderful. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. And if you've been watching this for 13 minutes, good. Oh. You finally got to see it, people. Mm. But that is pretty cool. Look at that. That's <coughs> absolutely perfect. Yeah. Man. And now you just wrap your fish in it and go for it. Let's do a little detail work over here on the flower. <laughs> and this is uh, being broadcast on John Likes to Travel with the likes with the number two travel. And you can follow me on Facebook and Instagram and YouTube. <coughs> so I put my little put my little dig in right now while we're waiting on finishing this little flower up. But that is amazing sure, the work he's doing. Oh, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Wow, fantastic, sir. Way to go. Way to go. That's just amazing. <laughs> This is a fishing net made out of carrot. It only took him 15 minutes. They did that for oh, every yeah, table. 15 minutes. Oh. Somebody did for wow. three tables. Way to go. 
Hello. So, again, it's John Likes to Travel signing off. I hope you like this YouTube video. Okay.